we're down at the Cobblestone Art Center B Yard as as overseen by one Mr. George McCullough. All right, so little insulation there. That's what we got. Oh, there's a lot of bees. Look at all those bees. They're hanging. They're saying, yeah, oh yeah, lots. Lots and lots. They're wondering, what are you doing opening my house? Yeah. Goodness. Well, that's good. They look healthy. I need that yellow. Okay, so we're going to go get a feeder. Here's the feeder. Do you want me to smoke these guys, or are you yep. just putting it right in? Here you go. There's a feeder. I'm going to get the smoker that's going here to calm these babies down. Alright. It's not even hitting them. It's alright. Drive them down in there. Go on. This is all food. I just put that in there. Okay. Boy, they're chowing down on this. Good. I like it. You can see the bees are hanging out here. See that? That's honey. That's that's honey in there. And there's probably brood down in there. Mm -hmm. And they're making baby bees. So we're gonna put this on top. Get the bees down, keep them out of the way. What they're gonna do with the liquid feed, they're gonna come up in the middle there and they're gonna eat or drink it through the screen. Ah. So what we have here now is a mix of honey, water, with bee healthy, which is uh, essential oils and stuff that really, really makes the bees go nuts. Thing is, is not to let this fall into the, onto the frames. You never want to get the frames wet with any of this stuff. This top feeder will hold four gallons easy. And when they start taking this in to make new bees, every 21 days they make new bees. So this is what we put in early in the year right yeah. because actually it's a little too early i'm doing an experiment here but you can see the bees come up in there now and they'll start eating that stuff up once they start making their own this helps collecting them. pollen and, and getting their yeah, own food this, this gets them a boost before the pollen starts on the natural uh, vegetation this gets them a good start uh, it helps them make a lot of wax. Wax is what you need, and you need a lot of drawn comb, and that's what gets you through the, the winter and uh, early spring. So, there we go. All right, so there it is. We're and they'll crawl up inside and come drink and then go back. Quite, quite busy bees.